The best League of Legends teams from across the globe fight for regional supremacy on their way to becoming the best in the world. Witness the spectacle in all its grandeur at the 2016 League of Legends Mid-Season Invitational Viewing Party this May 15 at the SM City North NC Cinema 8. Buy your tickets now and get a free Iron Inquisitor Kale skin with a chance to win awesome prizes. Who will reign supreme? So welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. We are now here for game two in the matchup between Imperium Pro Team and Acclaim Empire X. Of course, this is the Pro Gaming Series 2016 Summer Split, ladies and gentlemen. And this is powered by none other than... Bakus drive your energy. Of course, yes. And yung hindi na ubusan yung energy na mga shoutcasters today. My name is Aika. And of course, I'm Alpha. All right. So welcome, welcome, guys. And of course, gusto lang namin itake yung opportunity na ito to invite all of you tomorrow. We are now yes. in game four, patapos na. But let's not let the esports fever end because tomorrow we still have the. MSI, MSI viewing party tama, with tama. Rumble Royale and powered by or brought to you by Garena, of course, at SM, SM North, North Edsa. Edsa Cinema 8. Yes. So, yeah, guys, us well just drop by, say hi, watch with us, and of course, meron yung free Inquisitor Kale. Yes, so, so a lot of freebies, yes, the freebies raffle, also. opportunity to meet esports people, yes. plus exclusive games because it's going to be a match between Counter Logic Gaming versus South SKT. Korean Telecom T1. Yeah, so ayun guys, finals na yan ng MSI. Don't miss it. Have fun, enjoy esports with us tomorrow at SM North Edsa. At and of syempre, course, I would just like to. Muna. Oh, ano ina bangan? Yeah, pa rin ang mga viewers. Ang. Ang match and win wow! the code the code oh, sorry, the code sorry. all right so the match and win aex bundle of course that is a poro rider sejuani frozen terror nocturne challenger nidalee special weapon zack and a death blossom kazix guys be on the lookout it's now game four so most likely well wala na talaga dito the yes. code na yon. so ayun guys and remember Ay, ano ba? Remember, wala ngayon dito yung AEX. Well, isa lang. So, ayan, we see the player see. cameras right now. And isa lang yung representative ng AEX because the rest of the team are in Iloilo. So, shout outs to the players Ilo, over Ilo. there, guys. And to all the viewers right now enjoying um, week two of the Pro Gaming Series. So, now let us talk about the drafting Phase. So the drafting phase on the side of IPT. That will be Morgana, Twitch, and Maokai bands. And for the AEX, Echo, Gangplank, and Rise. Alright, so ano ba meron? Yeah, no, uh, no question na naman sa AEX. Have you, uh, have you encountered the Gangplank and Rise? Yung JL JLC's uh, Rise, really exceptional. Teleport, solo kill, flash, rune prison sa harap ni Gen V. Uh -huh. uh, Gangplank from Light. Medyo nahihirapan lang sila ng early game, but these two beast like, late game really oh, shines. Oh, syempre. And Echo has still the firepower. Oh, and on the side on. naman of IPT, Morgana, Twitch, Maokai, uh, no questions. This uh, lineup or this bands can really set up a really good 
team fights. Oh, oh, and we know naman na AEX is fond of that Twitch pick, and of course, again, the Maokai and Echo either must ban or must pick yes. so far in the Pro Gaming Series 2016. So, ayun, and then we have the picks over there. Um, IPT prioritizing that Alistar for Poisanity because in the game earlier we saw naman how yes. lethal that is. The three man to four man pulverize around the choke points and that flash pulverize headbutt that last fight on around the Baron. Oh, nga naman. So in response, AEX naman prioritizing their firepower in the Lucian and the Graves picks right there. Yes. Uh, it shines naman how Gen V uses the Lucian. It's just that JLC was really that ahead with the Flash Rune Prison. And yun nga, um, touch ko lang, uh, calculated using the Nashor uh -huh. Stood into the Roa, into the Lich, Lich Bing. So, uh, I'm not, it's not that I'm against it, pero hindi ganun nagamit yung itemization uh, type you're niya. not the big fan of it. Mm, yeah, uh, lalipat, uh, you're not converting your uh, damage into AP. Eh. Uh -oh. So why you go into a uh, attack speed if caster naman or mage yung gamit mo? So basically, if you're going for that Nash or either you go Azir, you go Kale, that really converts their damage into AP. Uh -oh. uh, kasi it really helps if you're going for a Lulu with full AP build, the shield plus the wild growth, and uh -oh. of course the burst from health picks and glitter lands. Uh -oh. You have seen, of course, Faker on Lulu, uh, Bjergsen, those yes. uh, famous uh, mid laners with that AP burst or Luden's Echo into the Rylice. That really helped a lot. Kaso yun nga, Nasher Stood was really a questionable pick. Uh oh, so ayun. And in response, Imperium Pro team picking Ooh. up that Kindred and Azir. So yeah, um, hindi na rin question yan. Uh, we have seen those uh, must ulit -ulit pick. Na. Yeah, oh, uh, must pick talaga. Tayo. And, and yun, then, Caitlyn hate the uh, well-known last game. And ito lang eh. Nakikita mo ba? Nakikita ko ay sa AEX. That's a Tom Kench on <laughs> Sinzi. Oh, uh, So Tom Kench and of course, as usual, Carl Kulated really favoring that John a mid laner, doesn't he? Okay. Ano meron? So yeah, na, uh, pa flex flex ng muscles to Mabuti naman CNN. at <laughs> and our players look like they're having a lot of fun, no? Yes. Enjoy so, na enjoy sila sa, sa player cam. Oo. Oh, mukhang ina-enjoy talaga nila kung ano yung may... Uy, may nawawala. Ano ba yan? <laughs> so yun, uh, guys, balik lang tayo sa drafting phase. Uh, mid lane card related. <laughs> he already pulled that one. Yes. Yeah, so Way he back, really right? is known for playing the Janna mid. The Janna mid in solo queue. And AEX as a team has learned to incorporate this into their composition. Yes. And ayun, so without further ado, guys, let's go to the roundup. So there you have it, Cannon with that 333 GPM as the top laner for Acclaim Empire X. And that was a very high kill participation, 50 per, uh, 57 57%. And Tamsu with a 70% kill participation as the jungler. So, siya yung ano, namesake ng bundle natin ngayon. Yes. And of course, Carl Culated with a 380 GPM. He is the mid laner for Acclaim Empire X. 380 GPM as well. And Gen V, 58% kill participation with a 382 GPM as the ADC. And last but not least, Sunzi with a 53% kill participation. 0.7 KDA and 243 GPM as the support. And for Imperium Pro Team, that will be JLC with a 74% uh, kill participation and 396 uh, GPM. Really high on that oh. one. Uh, on the jungle, that will be Suez, 79% kill participation and wow. 392 gold per minute. And yun nga. On the side, I'll be light. Imperium Pro Team, 61% kill participation. Gold per minute, that'll be 438. Wow. Massive gold that's, on that that's one. A lot. <laughs> and most massive, but in C hate with the gold per minute of 472 and 50%. So, kill participation. Uh, kill participation. And, and lastly, our uh, truly not like a set up. Boy, Sanity with 60% kill participation and 200 plus in, uh, GPM. Yes. Ayun, guys. So, 
Um, mad props to our stats guy, resident yes. stats guy, Mr. Marvin Isaac. So that would not have been possible without him the Iron from the Ambassador. Iron Ambassadors. So yung Iron Ambassadors natin, yan yung Iron stock Iron. natin ng mga talent pool, kumbaga, the writers yes. and content creators. Yes, and sila din yung madalas na set up ng mga tournaments uh -oh. around the place nila. Uh -oh. So, sila yung so really thank you, nice. thank you guys. And of course, let's not forget this game. Watch out for the match and win AEX bundle, yes. guys. Alam namin na marami sa inyo nag-aantay dyan. Of course, on top of the sick plays that will come in from both our teams. So, make sure to keep your eyes peeled. And again, we'd like to invite you to the MSI viewing party tomorrow. Yes, bukas na bukas din. Uh -oh. 300 pesos lang yan for a great, great, great Sunday spent watching esports with the community. So guys, 300 pesos, my Iron Inquisitor kill ka, my bago kang friends, my fan yes. signs ka pa sa idol mo. Ano and pa? <laughs> Nakita niyo ba sa uh, page ng Rumble Reality uh, posted the Steel Series Siberia? Ah, to give away? Yes, and a wow. GTA 5 <laughs> copy. Wow. Oh, ayun. So, guys, hindi na namin kayo kailangan i-convince. It's tomorrow. Yeah. What and else are you gonna do on yes. a Sunday, yeah, right? You can just drop Apart by, from chill chilling. Lang before Monday. Yeah. Kasi Monday na ulit, di ba? We all know we're going back dun sa mga commitments uh -oh. natin. So, yung iba kahit demons sila bumabalik sa commitment nila. I mean, ano? yung work. Yung work. Kasi maghahanap sila ng bagong work. May pinagdadaanan. Okay lang yan. Okay lang yan. Okay. So, yun guys. Um, so, and of course, thank you to all our viewers yes, right now. Thank you, thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much. For supporting the Pro Gaming Series 2016. Mag-comment, comment kayo dyan. Is it gonna be hashtag IPT win or hashtag AEX win? Who, whose side are you on? This is yes. now gonna be game two. Between Imperium Pro Team and Acclaim Empire X, this is Game 4 for Week 2 of the Pro, Pro Gaming, Gaming Series. Series Summer Split 2016, powered by Bacchus. Bacchus drive your energy. Yon. And see here, we are now looking at both teams heading into the fray with IPT branching out. Meanwhile, AEX, a strong unit there. Yes. Um, separate. They're just going to ward the entrances, I think, for the side of IPT. And AEX moving aggressively. Oh. Whoa, that was a gold advantage for <laughs> AEX. <laughs> Killing one yeah. ward. 25 gold. Nice right? one. 25 or <laughs> something. Nice one. Yes. That was a very good play. Very good play. Again. <laughs> But that was vision, denying. So, yun nga, uh, calculated on the mid lane, Jana. We have seen this last season, uh, season 3, I think, uh, we're in the hands of Taipei Assassin Toys. Yes. They, uh, uh, isa yun sa pinaka ano, uh, history maker na build. Oh. Yung mid, mid Jana, uh, Lulu, if I'm not mistaken, support Tarek, <laughs> then Jungle Nunu, then ADC Vayne. So you can see the combo the, from the ano, shield, the, protect, the steroid. Yeah. The vein, yun 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 they will not try to make anything more. Meanwhile, in the top lane, you have your standard trading as well. This is just gonna be standard lanes, guys. No more lane swap from what it looks like during this patch. Yes, so I uh, medyo inaabangan ko lang yung Shen. So, uh -huh. medyo nakita ulit natin siya on that or if to go yeah. hard. Since this is Strandle, so the subjugate really uh, whittle you down. Not really sure if he's going to win the trades later on. Mm. Because you know, the ult Shen is not really for himself. Uh -oh. So oh, there's no naman. possibly talaga na he can just... Whoa. Oh, and there you go! Wow, a pulverize onto Gen V though. Pero kinain ka agad siya ni Sunzi. Kaya siya ni Eleni Earth. <laughs> Ang cute niya eh. I really uh, like the skin. Yeah. So adorable. Yeah, it's, it but feels yeah. like it's not Tom, Tom Kench. A Tom Kench. Support so there. No, that no, is no going to be one. very anti fun. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Sunzi. Uh, playing the Zyra. 
last game is really uh, exceptional on that one. Really yeah. good play. Uh, but of course, boy, Sanity oh, going hard there once you go. again. Yes, a pulverize, a headbutt and pulverize onto Jen. I really love how po Sanity plays yung Alistar. headbutt niya. Yeah? Uh -huh. The headbutt. Uh, pag tumatama sa wall, uh -oh. talagang he's patiently waiting for it then For that pulverize. opportunity. Yeah. Kasi di ba madalas mabilis ang headbutt pulverize, but uh -oh. this one is really good on this Para, para yeah. ma-maximize yung yes, lockdown. Yes, sobrang na-maximize yung lockdown. And light, oh. fully calculated. Well, that is an Azir. Though, quite nice that, you know, the Janna pick, apart from it being a pocket pick for Calculated, it does allow for some protection. At least, no. Because that's the danger with ha playing against an Azir. Oh, no, but Poi Sanity in a bad position there. Gonna get a few hits from Gen V, but he comes right back in. Wow, onto Sunzi, and now Tamsu from the side. Exhaust is gonna be used on him, but Gen V with that nice first blood. JLC here a little bit too late on his teleport. And now Whoa, Calculated has come important. to respond as well. He is going to use that. Wow, oh no! He, oh my gosh, he did try and back away from all that damage, but he gets taken out in the process, and that is two kills for. AES. Wow, Would Jen be almost falling? That was a mistake for your uh, hate flashing on the wrong side of the map. Yeah, yeah. I'm not really sure. Is there. Uh, wala namang ibang. Uh, oh, but JLC coming right back whoa, in for some extra kill. fun there. He gets a kill off of Jen Now he's running away. But he can't because Tamsu is here as well and gets the kill off wow. of him. That will be a one for one, but that makes three kills now in the pocket for AEX. Oh my, IPT doing <laughs> the early game shenanigans of them. Well, of theirs. Yung, ano kasi, AEX is very is known to be quite aggressive. Naman talaga their play style. They're not the type na magsu slow choke of their um, ng enemy team. Yeah, but that was too much. Knowing that Tamsu is on the side, still manages to go in for sanity. Ah, yung and then the teleport, uh, a pale flash, and then a re engage only for uh, JLC. To fall. Oh. Yes, a single kill only. Well, that's the thing. Eh. You do notice they don't have any wards, right? IPT does not have any wards on the river. They just have that single pink ward on the tri bush, so not very surprising that they didn't. Um, they were caught unawares by AEX. Yes, indeed, and of course, uh, like didn't rotate. Calculated was there also to back up the team. Uh -oh. So it was a really good play and response from AEX. Well, Jana, yane, the response you will expect that she yes, will respond quite the, fast uh, compared to the Azir. Having the uh, the unique passive. Yes. From Jana. His forecaster is around the map to check the weather. <laughs> oh, Suez, he responded out by Whoa. the ward there. And that is an aggressive play by Light, but A doesn't trade. materialize yes. into any kills because Calculator did flash away from the ultimate. And of course, Divide yes. has been used. And no big plays for Light, but we're trying. Lost uh, the flash on the process. And yeah, uh, IPT taking it slowly right now since they're uh, behind sila from that, uh, oh. those missteps. And I think naman they can still, you know, of course, early game pa lang. They have uh, seen oh. all. Oh. Hate though, taking a lot of harass from Genvi and Sunzi. And now in the mid lane here, we have Calculated slowing down light in his path. Samsung with a backup damage, but you know, Azir, the Emperor is a little bit too safe already. Yes, indeed. And on the top lane with a skirmishes once again. But we have seen Trundle already ahead on his item and of course DCS. So that will be a 20 advantage. Yes. So yeah. 20 CS advantage in the hands of Canon. So major uh -oh. iba na uh, he's not getting bullied now from Shen, so medyo nag manifest na yung Rise ban and of course the Maokai ban. Uh -oh. Putting him on his Shen. And yun nga, uh, misstep oh. from the teleport and uh, oh, of course he's dead on the early skirmish. Yes, and in the bot lane though, Hate getting very, very low. He's, the pressure from nice. Gen V is real. Meanwhile, in the top lane here, um, Cannon has been marked by Suez. 
And he is circling around from the back. This will erupt into a fight. So here we go. Suez coming in from the side onto Cannon right there. But he's already too far too safe. And that will not be a kill just yet. That was an oop down for uh, Cannon. Subjugate has been forced to use. And on the bot lane, Heat has been catching too much poke or damage. Yeah. And here comes the confidence naman from Tamsu. Going uh, deeper into their jungle. Tamsu, no, very aggressive. So far, he has been able to respond to all of the team fights from um, initiated by AEX. So very, very good there on the side of yes, AEX. And, and they now they the words. Yeah, and now they've rotated actually to get that first Drake. That will be a mountain Drake if I'm not whoa. mistaken. And whoa, Emperor's Divide will be used here in the mid lane by light but will that be a kill ladies and gentlemen meanwhile the dragon has been taken by gen v the first dragon of the game goes to aex and yes that was a very good trade and not really trade because i went to but um light wasn't able to hit the emperor's divide though it's kind of but on the fight on the top lane that will be cannon going hard to jlc and oh. a win fight with that grasp of the undying finishes off Canon. Yes. So, Kala ko skirmish lang eh. Medyo okay. pinapanood ko lang sila maglaban nung nagkababaan nyo ng buhay. It's the usual. It's the yes, usual. Yes. No, I thought it but was no. really the usual. But no. Someone died. Ayun. So, it is going to be, it was indeed a mountain drake. Yes. So, there so you have it. Much power from the uh, sieges and damage, true damage from the monsters. Uh, it will really help them, nga, yun nga, uh, sieging putting towers down, knowing that you have cannon on the team. Uh -huh. Malaking tulong yan. Having the frozen domain, mm -hmm. the frozen domain or the, uh, of course, the light slingers double attack. Malaking bagay yun sa team nila. That will can really go into pushing or a very good answer against light and hate sieging power. It's Meanwhile, not as much as yes. malakas tulad ng Azir Arise and hates headshot to the tower, uh -oh. but still, that was a power, kaya malaking bagay or oh, health. Oh, Tamsu just gonna walk right in front here, and now JLC uses his ultimate to back his teammate up, but Tamsu will flash the safety there. Cannon, though, coming in with a flank from behind, gets onto JLC with Tamsu running in straight from behind his teammates with Carl Culated as well. Three people from AEX chasing down Imperium Pro Team. Ladies and gentlemen, will this be? Some kills for them, not necessarily. Well, the, the rotation once again from Calculated. So, bigla na siya napupunta sa top, no? Kung minsan, bigla na napupunta sa bot, eh. Oo, oh, oh, ang bilis siya talaga mag-respond. But yes. no surprise because it is a Janna. And no, here in the bot lane, though, the excitement isn't going to end. Whoa. And in the mid lane, Light forced to use the Emperor's device to disengage against Calculated and Tamsu. Tamsu very aggressive this game. Medyo uh, mas naging mabagal yung pace ng game ngayon compared sa first game na nagiging one-side and laning. Uh -oh. uh, so medyo mas nabubuli ngayon yung IPT and they are forced to play passively. But on the top lane, JLC going hard to cannon. Oh. Aika, we have a fight! Do we? Do we have a fight? Doesn't look like it though. But Not in the bot again. lane, Culling will be popped by Genby there. Hate lane on some damage from the back line with Poise Sanity keeping the enemy bot lane duo at bay. And in the mid lane, we have here a slow onto light by Calculated. He's just going in hot, hot with his shield. Woo. Whoa! Whoa, there, a sneaky, sneaky ultimate by Tamsu nets him the kill onto light. And now Suez jumping into the danger face and head on. But that forced was to back. Very good collateral damage. Yeah. I have seen that one. Uh, if you know uh, Cloud9 play Rush, oh, oh, he really Rush, loves no. doing that Very over the wall. Very <laughs> that uh, jungler. Yes, yeah. indeed. So, yeah, oh. uh, if you do want to watch international teams once again, MSI tomorrow. Yes, guys, the MSI viewing party. Catch it tomorrow at SM North Edsa with Rumble Royale, Garena, and all your beloved esports personalities. Whoa. Meanwhile, in the bot lane, they also love some esports. There you go. <laughs> we have Pulverized by Poise Sanity. Sunzi eats his AD carry to safety. That so, was very yeah. confident. Uh, Headbutt Pulverize under the turret. Yeah, very, 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 <laughs> very confident. Bold in that one. Considering how painful that could have been for IPT. And 
As I check the items, calculated banner of command. Wow, very. So I guess they're really first item banner of command. Yes, they are going for the. I, I'm not Press sure if it's go to the uh, lane pressure or split push, but indeed it will <laughs> put some pressure. <laughs> yes, obviously. <laughs> yes, banner yun yun. Oh, and now IPT is going to take this Rift Herald for free. They have. Wars around the area. Meanwhile, AEX does not, so they they will be very unaware of this, unless Cannon actually spots them out. He does, but a little bit too late there, ladies and yes. gentlemen. And Rip Carroll goes to JLC. Yes, a uh, very good zoning for uh, for Caitlyn for hate, putting the, uh, those traps to let them farm freely. But of course, the river is not yet that safe. And then, knowing oh. the, the rotation from Graves, uh, Tamsu, and of course, our beloved uh, rotator, rotator. calculated. Very okay. good. Again, I am admiring the fast, very fast response time of yes. AEX. And for example, here right now in the jungle, we have Suez being spotted out by Tamsu. Whoa. Calculated with the backup shield there, and the kill goes, of course, to Tamsu. And now they're chasing down Light. Whoa. Light comes in and uses Emperor Divide to toss them under Whoa. turret. Whoa, and all that pain shut down onto Tamsu by Light. And now in the bot lane, Sunzi getting really, really ham here onto Hit. Tries that to slow him down, much. underestimates the turret hit, and dies in the process. And that will be a kill for Whoa. Hit. Meanwhile, in the top lane, Carl Culated getting tossed away from Poisanity. Bit of a misplay there. But that was a really good play for Light, putting the Emperor's Divide. And yeah. two man, Emperor's Divide yeah. forces them. To flash away and the JLC. Sands into the yes, the Shurima Shuffle. Divide. And then uh, JLC nice. responding with the stand, United We Stand, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, the Flash Taunt. I mean, stand taunt United, flash. yeah. Stand United, yeah, that's so right. So they're taking advantage. Oops. Oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah, this got a hurt. Blooper. So, so there, we have them taking advantage of that early turret. Um, now we have the Infernal Dragon, the second dragon of the game, ladies and gentlemen, goes instead to Imperium Pro Team. So yes. mukhang hindi naman that strong yung objective control right now ng AEX. Medyo nag fallback yung AEX because of that play shutting down. Of, not really shutting down, pero it, uh, it will slow them down. Uh-oh. Oh, oh eh, kasi that was, that was both on Tamsu. Yeah. And uh, coordinated, so it's yeah. uh, really not that good. And yun nga, uh, having the Infernal Drake, another firepower subjugate oh. has been on the top lane. Aika, we have a fight! Yes, let me stop you there because now Cannon is in trouble here in the top lane. JLC and Light laying on a lot of pain here. They are going to force Cannon to flash away. They will not pursue this anymore! Tama na! So yeah, uh, Poisanity can uh, chase the, on that one since yun nga, yung flash niya is kakagamit lang niya on that play. Yeah. Semi so lane after the Emperor's Divided Banner of Command doing the work, the damage. There you the go. Power. A lot of Howling Gales there coming in from Calculated. Well, nakagulat talaga. First item, Banner of Command. Banner of Command. They want to be able to pressure. Well, I still naman because if you use that Banner of Command, it does put a lot of pressure in the lane that you want, especially if the if the goal of AEX here is to maintain a strong hold on objectives. Yes, indeed. So you know, uh, mentioned good now. So way back on season three, uh, it was it has been in by toys, but uh, he used the AP scaling for the shield and of course in damage ng Zephyr and yung Howling Gale. Uh -oh. It's an AP scaling. And damage, damage someone here. Comes on oh, the but in the icon. mid lane, Tom, so you're in trouble there. Suez is right in your face. He does have red buff, but it will not be enough. Forces Tamsu to use his flash to run away from that. And no one will die just yet. Meanwhile, in the bot lane, here, calculated, taking all of these traps. Yes, so that will slow you down from that fight on the mid lane. Going yeah. back, Tamsu, uh, akala ko kakayanin niya si Suez eh. Oh, oh. Pero Light is close. So any anytime, pwede siyang uh, shifting sands into the Emperor's oh. Divide. Once again, that's gotta hurt. 
headshot to headshot. And wow, calculated. Whoa, there. Just Whoa. really tanking those turret hits and stepping on that trap like it's no problem. Gets really low. They will have to abandon the siege of the bot lane. That was a really bad uh, decision for AEX sticking down on the bot lane, not even thinking that the mid lane we have an Azir that arise get to the turret. So yeah. basically, it's a fast pusher, and the Nasher stood has been already built. So your attack speed nya is really uh, good. You may not use the Arise. Yes. You can just go ahead and normal hit the turret. And so far, not a lot of magic resist on the side of AEX just yet. Yes, just one. Mm -hmm. I, uh, not really. Yeah. But uh, uh, AEX is a fusion. Oh, Culling will be popped in the top lane. Does this mean they're going in ham for a fight? Mm, doesn't no. seem like it. Meanwhile, we have Suez circling around. They smell blood in the water. Tamsu is really low and they might want to take this red buff Whoa. away from him. Now, like Whoa. here with... Oh my gosh! With Suez on the side as well, he Another uses ultimate, good. and now with that red buff, that has got to hurt. Light takes the kill off of Tamsu, and, and now this will jeopardize the bot lane. Exactly, because Suez is rotating to the bot lane now. That that is four people from IPT putting on some heat right there. And yes, and Tamsu not really aware on that one. He thought it was just a normal Emperor's divide. But yes. uh, and na pala si Kindred uh -oh. and, and, uh, good play once again for IPT and touch kala uh, Sunzi uh, on Tom Kench. Hindi ko pa nakikita nag shine yung ult niya. Like yes. to set up we haven't seen it. Yeah, we haven't seen the flanks. Well, behind. though hindi naman siya totally. I mean, yung lineup na Manila is not totally for a flank or a gang type. Yeah. So medyo. Pero uh, I, I was thinking that Jana. Can use a Howling Gale or a Flash Monsoon uh, with the Abyssal to Voyage. Someone. Yes, with the Abys Abyssal Voyage, and that will be uh, bringing Gen V into the mid lane to shut down light. Yes, and in now in the top lane, we have a fight breaking out here, Whoa. ladies and gentlemen. The pillar will be used to stop them in their tracks, and that might be just it. But no! Oh, oh wow, the taunt there yes. from JLC onto Tamsu. Tamsu seems like he's underestimating IPT once again. And now I've poised Sanity coming in from the side, forced to use Unbreakable Will here. Sunzi here as well with some insurance for his carries. And now Hate is gonna be off to the side here, taking out some wards from the enemy. That was uh, Poise Sanity. Ready na mag three man knock up eh. Oo, nag unbreakable will yes, pa nga eh. Yes, kasi nakita niya yung anina ni, ano, ni Sunzi. Ay, kakainin lang to. Wag na lang. Oo, sayang lang. So yeah, but the sieging power of course of IPT with that power of Infernal Dragon APAD damage uh, buff. Yeah, and they have got to hurt, especially considering yes. that that's a lot of poke coming in from both a Caitlyn and, and an Azir. Azir. So yeah, and of course, Azir already. Oh, oh, so from the side there, a flash play, pulverized from Poison. Wow. But soon has been used, and so is Emperor's Divide there. A lot of pain here. Cannon trying to isolate three people of IPT, keeping them away from the carries. And meanwhile, JLC is here on the back. You have not saved your carries at all, because JLC that will be a double kill for again. me. That's JLC right there. Whoa. Now Light trying oh, no, to catch Calculated much. goes the wrong way, and now he's deep in Whoa. the base of AEX. Jet V just one. has to pop Culling, and that is a kill onto Light. That Whoa. is Oh, but it doesn't stop there, though. Jet V calling to Suez. Pulling out some shocking plays. <laughs> the first one, a very good flank with Poise Sanity, with the, uh, of course, fighting all around, and then saw some red lines just jumping in. And this last one, a ton cash na naman. Yeah, so it's looking kind of bad for AEX because that was four kills for IPT. And now, actually, a lot of their turrets have Whoa. fallen. Now we it's have the ultimate coming in from Sundi. He has brought Tamsu in the face here. Both junglers flash. And now the gap has been closed. Whoa. And that is a yeah, kill hurt, onto man. Suez. Easy peasy from Tamsu. Now Hate has been Whoa, spotted out damage. by Calculated. 
the slow onto him, the Howling Gale, the headbutt onto Tamsu to keep him away from hate, but that will not be enough because he will just shift through the wall Whoa. there. And now coming in light with the Emperor's Divide. Oh my, Kate is gonna get shut down by Cannon here. And we have three people onto Cannon for that revenge kill. Light gets a double kill from this fight, killing off Sun Z in the process. And Cannon, Kate. that is three people out. Hate on the panic button. Just <laughs> caliber net on the other side where the fight is already Happening. erupting. Yeah. Yes, so at least so Hulk calculated. Oh, and then he JLC just goes though. In. Still pretty Whoa. bloodthirsty, forces cal calculated to use Monsoon, and now Gen V trying to free hit, knows that his mid laner is doomed, leaves him to die, and now Light gets another kill. The so, guy has five kills already. Yes, ito na yung fight ng IPT, their uh, team play shining out, showing how this Poisonity and JLC set up the play. And of course, Knight yeah. putting out the damage, a long range damage with a very good Emperor's Divide once again on a choke point. Sobrang magandang setup for the yes. team of IPT. And that fight opened up Dragon for IPT. That is their first Mountain Drake and the third Dragon of this game, guys. So now they also have the ability to further push down these um, enemy turrets that is two inner turrets left for AEX. They are in a lot of trouble right now. Um, supposedly, the way that they would have come back from this is to secure those dragons since they did get yes. the jump start on that first dragon. But wait, ladies and gentlemen, are you seeing this? It is the match and win code for match that AEX bundle. Win. That Whoa. will be a town band bundle with Poro Sejuani, yes. Frozen Terror so Nocturne. Challenger Needly Special Weapon Zack and Death Blossom Kazix Aika. Open your client, type in those letters. Hurry, 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 and get that bundle, guys. And Shepre, if you do get it, ipag show off yun na jan sa chat kung kayo yung nauna, guys. Yes, is ano post yun yung screenshot ipag malaki oh, yun sa mga friends nyo, bundle na celebrate. bundle yung mga friends. Celebrate, we will celebrate with you. Wag mo na pahinggan yung mga na salty dahil di nila nakuha. Okay yes. lang yan. It's all on to you, wherever you are. Oh, and oh. yes, thank you so much for watching us. And we are still on the battle between AX and IPT. Yeah, so this is game four for tonight, guys. Day two of week two, Pro Gaming Series Summer Split 2016, powered by... Bakus, drive, drive your, your energy. energy. So yes, ni pa naubos energy natin. Yes, tulit tulit pa rin ang bakbakan dito, Aika. <laughs> Oo, oh, oh, Saturday night to Saturday night. And we're partying here on the Rift, guys. It is 25, 25 minutes into this game. We are at 13-8 on the scoreboard. IPT currently has a 6k goldie over AEX and three turrets ahead. And now they're even getting the first Baron wow, of this game. Wow, burn them down. And they do. And that is a free Baron. Wow, a cancel TP from Poise, uh, from Poise Sanity. Oh no, no but hold on there. Poise Sanity getting really, really ham onto Sunzi. Forced to use his Unbreakable Will. Genby does pop pulling while he can lay on a lot of damage onto three people there. Whoa. JLC right in the middle here on AX. Monsoon to disengage, but now Genby is coming in, taking a lot of hits to the face. And now Cannon as well with the Lamb's Respite. Um, Emperor's Divide to push him away, Whoa. but will that be enough? Hate does get a kill there, and Light is on a rampage. Hate with a double kill, ladies and gentlemen. And Suez as well. He Papa Huli my kill then shot. That's four people down on the side of AEX, and that is 17-8. JLC being exceptional on that dive, knowing that uh, under turret yung laban na yun. It still, they manages to pull it off really clean and smooth on the side yes, of IBT. Yes, and of course, with that Baron buff, he knows they are going to be able to pull it off. Okay. And of course, they do have the 10k gold. These JLC just kind of BMing cannon right now, guys. All right, so... Yes. So, yeah, uh, I got to touch. Um, uh -huh. Kindred. Where I'm looking at uh, Suez Kindred. It's a uh, warrior type build yes, with, with a black cleaver shiv. and static shiv, uh -huh. which is currently uh, finished. Strange build, knowing that uh, not that strange. I mean, matagal na talaga yung warrior type na Kindred uh -huh. and with the black cleaver. Pero knowing that the uh, yun, of course you know Blood Razor, 
bandwagon. I mean, <laughs> the blood, the, uh, ano, uh, blood, ra blood razor damage. Talagang yes. inexpect ko na another kindred carry, but I think si solely focused for the uh, tankiness in a bit, uh -huh. while providing a very good amount of damage. Yes, that is true. In this patch, six point nine blood razor is the favored um, item yes, for that indeed. kindred. And I'm still so, waiting if he's going to use Ginsu Rage Blade. Because I'm not sure how much I'm going to do. Yeah, I'm not sure how much I'm going to do. With that Phantom Hit, na yung heal ni Kindred is sobrang bilis bumalik. AD si yes. Kindred siya with that Ginsu Rage Blade. Sobrang hirap paalisin sa lane. So just giving you an idea, guys. But I'm not really sure if it's a really good one. But go, just go try it out on the normals, not on oh. the ramp. APD do doing the work on the bot lane, of course. They have the buffs, they have the items, and of course, yes. the advantage. And AEX just trying to do what they can to keep them away from their turrets, but to no avail. I feel like this is going to be win for IPT. What do you think? Like, can AEX still do something like a last ditch effort? I mean, they've already lost two dragons to IPT as well as that Baron buff. They don't really have map control right now, apart from what's cur what's close in their vicinity. So, I'm not a big fan of what's happening. Well, actually, uh, they can really slow it down. Like, I think oh! you know, the but fight But wait a erupting. second, there you go. Poise Sanity again, and JLC with that, with a very aggressive play right there. And now, Cannon trying his best to get back Whoa. in the base. Tamsu getting tossed around here by both JLC and Light and Calculated now locked down as well. Four of his teammates have already been killed. He will just run for his life and like we said, I guess this is game. Wow, this is too much for AEX to handle. This snowball from IPT pushing them against the wall. What's next, AEX? IPT taking out the game in the hands yes. of Acclaim Empire X, securing their second win into the PGS Congratulations, played like true champion veterans. There you go, guys. Imperium Pro Team, yan, yang, yan ang epekto ng international experience, experience. nila. Flawless so, and strong. Grabe, grabe talaga. It was the, at the time that the game ended, we had like 13k gold lead on the side of IPC. Yes. So that is very shocking, actually. Um, you don't want that to happen, but... Would you would you say that's a surprise? It's not really a surprise, but uh, I know how, or I really do understand how AEX want want this to pan out. But yes. this is an illusion. If you're going to protect uh, the carry comp, Graves is good, Jana is good, uh, Tom Kench is good, but Lucian. Lucian, not It's not really so a much. hyper carry. Yeah. Providing the late game, if you're going for a Kogma or a Jinx or a Vayne, I would really understand. Yeah. So what's the standing like icon? The vein with the Ginsu Rage Blade. So now, guys, as we come to a close, that is two wins for G-Hub and two wins for IPT. IPT. And that will be Game 4 for Week 2 here in the Pro Gaming Series 2016 Summer Split. Ladies and gentlemen, exciting, exciting matches and very explosive matchups there. So before we end, guys, I would like to again invite all of you. Yes, all of you. Lahat na mga nag-aaway dyan. Lahat na mga kinikilig dyan sa mga plays. Lahat na mga fanboys ng IPT or AEX, G-Hub or Infused. Guys, lahat tayo. Let us unite tomorrow at the MSI viewing party with Rumble Royale, Garita, all the esports people. Yes, guys, abang abang ano yan? Ano si Rico Shinbu? Ano yun si pareng Manjin? And of course, big big shoutouts kay Rina Garina. So ayon. Rina Garina. Yes, Rina. Kay Nick. Yeah, and KK, it's like Garina Pips. So yeah, may kita nyo rin sila tomorrow, guys. Please drop by and. Have your pictures taken with us if you want. Yes. To. So of course that's going to be 12 p.m. at SM North Edsa. Cine. Ladies and gentlemen, 300 pesos for that ticket. See you there. All right. We we will yes. see you there. So yes, big big shout outs to everyone who was watching. Um, I I personally would like to thank the people who have been supporting me so far. Thank you, thank you for all the comments, especially about the feedback about shoutcasting as well. Yes. We're very really proud and very happy. And ayun, shout out to the pro players for G-Hub in Pampanga, AEX in Ilo, Ilo, Ilo. So guys, keep keep going for your dreams here at esports. And of course, 
you will have the energy because we have Bacos drive, drive your, your energy. energy. So keep chasing those esports dreams with us. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching us tonight thank you so much. on a Saturday. Again, it has been a pleasure shoutcasting for you. The, my name is Aika and with me is it's one and only Alpha. Yes, and earlier was Manjin. So, ladies and gentlemen, we are signing off. Exhaust is going to be used on him, but Gen V with that nice first blood. JLC here a little bit too late on his teleport. And now Whoa, Calculated has come party. to respond as well. He is going to use that. Wow. Oh, no. Hey. Oh, my gosh. He did try and back away from oh, for some extra kill. fun there. He gets killed off of Gen V. Now he's running away. But he can't because Tamsu is here as well and gets the kill off wow. of him. That would be a one for <laughs> Pero, um, Light wasn't able to hit the Emperor's Divide, though it's kind of. But on the fight, on the top lane, that would be Cannon going hard to JLC and oh. a win fight. And he's just going in hot, hot with his shield. Woo. Whoa! Whoa, there, a sneaky, sneaky ultimate by Tamsu. It nets him the kill onto Light. And now Suez jumping into the danger. Face and Light. Whoa. Light comes in and uses Emperor Divide to toss them under Whoa. turret. Whoa, and all that pain shut down onto Tamsu by Light. And now in Whoa. the bot lane, Sunzi getting really, really happier onto Hate. Tries that to slow him down, much. underestimates the turret hit, and dies in the process of away from him. Now Light Whoa. here with. A Oh my gosh, with Suez on the side as well, he Another uses ultimate good. and now with that red buff, that is oh. so from the side there, a flash play, pulverized from Poison, wow. and what soon has been used and so is Emperor's Divide there, a lot of pain here, Cannon trying to isolate three people of IPT, keeping them away from the carries, and meanwhile JLC is here on the back, you have not saved your carries at all because JLC that will be a double kill for again. me, that's JLC right there, Whoa. now light, Trying oh, no. to catch Calculated, much. goes the wrong way, and now he's deep in Whoa. the base of AEX. Jet just one. has to pop. The gap has been closed, Whoa. and that is a Got kill. It. Out by it. Calculated, the slow onto him, the Howling Gale, the headbutt onto Tamsu to keep him away from Hit, but that will not be enough because he will just shift through the wall Whoa. there. And now coming in light with the Emperor's Divide. Oh my, Hit is gonna get shut down by Cannon here. And we have three people onto Cannon for that revenge kill. Light gets a double kill from this fight. Kill Monsoon, and now Genvy trying to free hit. Knows that his mid laner is doomed. Leaves him to die, and now Light. Oh no, but hold on there. Poise Sanity getting really, really half onto Sun. He forced to use his unbreakable will. Genvy does pop. Pulling while he can lay on a lot of damage onto three people there. Whoa. JLC right in the middle here on AX. Monsoon to disengage, but now Genby is coming in, taking a lot of hits to the face. And now Cannon as well with the Lamp's Respite. Um, Emperor's Divide to push him away, Whoa. but will that be enough? Hate does get a kill there, and Light is on a rampage. Hate with a double kill, ladies and gentlemen, and Suez as well. He needs Papa Holy. Slow it down, like I be Oh! But wait a erupted. second, there you go, Poi Sanity again, and JLC with that, with a very aggressive play right there. And now, Cannon trying his best to get back Whoa. in the base. Tamsu getting tossed around here by both JLC and Light. And Calculated now locked down as well for a bit. IPP taking out the game in the hands yes. of Acclaim Empire X, securing their second win into the PGS.